Hello fellow plant enthusiasts. So I want to show you guys how terrariums make for excellent gnat traps. You know they notice the moisture in the terrarium and it's more you know has more moisture than the surrounding air. So they'll find their way in if the terrarium is not completely sealed as seen with this um, lid on this terrarium. And they'll fly in and they'll get trapped. And as you can see I have a ton of gnats so consequently, the room I had these plants in that had a lot of gnats, you know, I have two addresses, one in Greensboro and one in Indian Trail. And I had a gnat problem in Indian Trail a few months ago and I finally eradicated them, but I was starting to have a gnat problem up in Greensboro. But as you can see, I got rid of most of the gnats without even needing vinegar. Now, if I take this thing off, of course, they'll fly out, but what you want to do is use some hydrogen peroxide. They come in a dark bottle, so you don't want to store it in a light bottle, but for now, I just put it in a spray bottle to squirt in here. So I'm just going to squirt it up in here. And hydrogen peroxide is a little caustic. You know, it oxidizes, so it will help get rid of fungi and any of the eggs and larvae of the gnats that are in here because this retains moisture. These gnats find their way in here. They're going to thrive. You know, they're going to start breeding in the media and they're going to start growing. And hydrogen peroxide is actually good for the roots of the plants. And in a terrarium setup, they can help do a little aeration if you accidentally overwater. Of course, if you set up a terrarium without putting way too much water, you don't even need all these different layers of media like most people think you do. So anyway, now that I've eradicated, well, sprayed a little bit of peroxide, I'm gonna do a little bit more spraying and then eventually I'll have to take some nice long tongs and clean the dead gnat carcasses off the glass. But you can see that this begonia foliosa is starting to do well. It looks happy. The miniature wandering Jews, I do need to tend to them a little bit. They're getting a little stringy, even though they were on a west-facing window. But overall, I'm satisfied with this terrarium and glad that it um, got trapped all these gnats for me. You know, last week I had gnats flying around and now just in a few days, they're all in here. Isn't that wonderful? Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and happy planting.